keep an eye on things here heading into our Sunday morning. Then another round is going to come in on Monday. For now, though, things are pretty quiet for us outside. We're looking to the west over downtown from our tower camera. We're at 69 degrees, the wind out of the north at 9 miles an hour. Humidity 57%, so it is a little higher than it was earlier this evening, but our air is still relatively dry uh, as far as getting any rain in here. So still going to be dry at least over the next several hours. We're at 73 in Lee Summit and Belton and Olathe. Lawrence at 73, Leavenworth 69 degrees. A little cooler in Maryville at 64, 73 in Clinton and 75 for Sedalia. Lots of clouds overhead, but we're not quite seeing any rain just yet. That's still going to continue to hold off here a little bit longer. But as we head closer towards sunrise tomorrow, notice how showers, even a few thunderstorms will drift in. This is a look at 7 o'clock in the morning on your Sunday. So scattered rain, maybe a few rumbles won't last very long. In fact, I think by about 9 or 10 that moves out of here. Still some lingering clouds midday and then after that we clear those clouds out, meaning more sunshine for your Sunday afternoon. Won't be quite as warm as today. We had a high of 81 degrees, but still should be pretty nice for this time of year with those temperatures back in the low to mid 70s. So your Sunday breakdown, if you're going to be out uh, doing some gardening, maybe just hold off in the morning. Impact part of your day is going to be before 8 a.m. or before 9 a.m. Really, that's one of those chances for showers and a few thunderstorms. Lingering clouds after that, which will eventually start to clear towards midday. 67, that's your lunchtime temperature. And then we're looking at more of those lower 70s for the afternoon and a northeast wind at about 5 to 10. So second half of your day looks great. First part of your day, we may be dodging a little bit of rain. Forecast highs, about 73 in Liberty, 73 for Kansas City, Belton, Olathe, Lee Summit, Overland Park, Leewood. Look for highs in the low to mid 70s for tomorrow. Drier weather for the afternoon. On Monday, we have another round of rain and thunderstorms coming in. So this is a look at 7 o'clock in the morning Monday. As we head towards midday, notice how this complex of thunderstorms will drift in. You see how it gets a little more red, a little more purple here around 11 a.m. We'll be watching for the potential for some stronger thunderstorms here heading towards the middle of the day and into the afternoon for around the metro and areas southward midday on for the potential for some stronger thunderstorms. 6 p.m. still a few lingering showers and storms Warrensburg and Sedalia along 50 highway and again this will be on your Monday. Nine day forecast after that we're going to see some cooler temperatures eventually make a return especially later next week. Tomorrow's high 73 degrees impact for those morning showers and few thunderstorms a morning temperature of 57. Another impact on Tuesday for that potential of seeing severe weather. So we're going to watch for that around the metro and area southward. You see it here in yellow. That's for the possibility of some severe thunderstorms. So again, that's going to be on your Monday around midday into the early afternoon. We'll continue to fine tune that forecast. So tune in tomorrow morning. Katie Horner will have an update on that. Tuesday Cinco de Mayo looks great. Wednesday 68 degrees for high temperature sunshine. We'll watch for rain chances Thursday into Friday. And then as we head into next weekend, Mother's Day on Sunday looks nice as of right now with a high temperature of 64 degrees. So Emily, some rain chances here coming in for tomorrow. We're going to keep an eye on Monday after that though. Cooler temperatures, in fact, quite a bit cooler heading into next weekend.